Dynacord MXC Matrix Mix Engines offer a control port with configurable general purpose inputs and outputs, commonly known as GPIOs. This video shows how to configure MXE GPIO logic to load DSP presets using contact closures or a control panel with open collector outputs. As a first step, we need to correctly set up MXE GPIOs 1 through 4. Go to Setup GPIO, click Matrix 1. In order to recall DSP presets, we need to set MXE GPIOs 1 through 4 as digital in. For this example, the MXE needs to have four presets labeled U01 through U04 loaded in advance. In the menu to the left, click Logic Task. Drag a Logic Task block to the workspace. Click Logic Task again. Then add a block labeled My Job Name to the workspace. And connect it to the Logic Task block by dragging it onto the Name connection cutout. Rename it as Load Preset U01. Click Logic Input, and then click GPIO. Now drag an MXE Digital GPI block to the workspace. Connect the block to the Input Device connection cutout. Click Logic Output, and then click Preset. Drag the MXE Preset block onto the Output Device connection cutout. The MXE Preset block is embedded into an Only When Input Reads block, which is important for it to function correctly. Finally, click Devices. Then drag the Matrix 1 device block onto the Input Devices cutout. Right-click the Matrix 1 device block then click Duplicate. Connect the duplicated block to the Output Device connection cutout. For a quicker and more efficient workflow, simply duplicate the complete logic task block three times. Continue by editing the name on the second block to read Load Preset U02. Then change the PIN number on the second IPX Digital GPI block to 2, and the preset number on the duplicated MXE preset block to U02. Now we're ready to set up the third block. Change the name to Load Preset U03, and select 3 as the PIN number on the MXE Digital GPI block. In order to complete this block, choose U03 on the MXE preset. Finally, repeat these adjustments for the fourth and last logic task block by labeling it as Load Preset U04, selecting number 4 on the MXE Digital GPI pin, and choosing U04 on the MXE preset. Finally, once you've finished defining tasks and are online with your system, Click the Deploy button to start the tasks running on the MXE5. If you're not yet online, or the logic configuration is incomplete, the button will not activate. Congratulations! You can now load MXE presets U01 through U04 with GPI Digital Inputs 1 through 4.